Welcome back to Lawnmower. So if you read my objectives, they say go to the mecha strip when you are done. I do need to go into the bank vault and get that book from the library first. Uh, so I really should not have come here quite so soon. I actually, uh... This is the second attempt at recording this episode. I went down there, there's no way in, and uh, had some trouble getting back. It wasn't impossible, but it was awkward. So what I need to do is go deal with the library and stuff. Okay. Not that door. I want the City Watch door. Not the Spooky Ghost door. So. Um, in the failed recording this episode, I... did not manage to make any progress uh, on the library or the bank vault or anything. In both cases I thought there was something else missing. Right. Uh, it's alright. And it's true there was stuff I was missing and I have since looked it up so that I can hopefully make progress and finish this mission in this episode. And with any luck, it won't take too long, and I can get started on episode. Well, not episode. Uh, mission two. One more north. One of the things that was bugging me is this window key. I've never found a use for it. Picked it up in the bank. Found a use for it. Apparently, it's not relevant in in uh, this mission. It's, it seems very strange to have a missable object. I mean, I suppose maybe it just gives you. Access to more loot. Next miss. Next mission. We'll see. Anyway, time to go to the library. Ah, uh, what's the point? If someone was here, yeah, there's no point. If someone was there, they're long gone now. Actually, maybe I should be. Doing the bank vault first. This is the bank, right? That's the bank. Right, I need to get down there anyway. And go up through Brigantia's chimney. Uh, to get to the bank vault. So I was going to say, like, um, you could use the teleporter, right? To get to the magnetic place. At least, I think so. Let's go to the library first. <laughs> um, yeah, that roof is accessible. Or should be accessible. Okay, so there. Yeah, so, so looking for a code in the library, it wasn't. It's, it's a very long time ago. I found this both cards. One nine one seven, I guess, which was next to the library key. I had no idea what it was for. 
There's nothing. Yep, cabinet key. Um, I guess maybe it was next to the library key. I don't remember now. It's too long ago. But by the time I was here in the library, I had no nothing in my head to connect it with this. So I'm very glad I looked it up. Okay, now just give me access to the cabinet here, which... Um... What? The picture of the bathroom mirror? There's a picture of the bathroom mirror. Okay. Strange thing to keep locked in a filing cabinet, but bathroom is upstairs, right? Okay, the mirror. Give me lock picked. picture of a bookcase in a corner near a painting and a red curtain. Alright. Which is not any of these desks. It's gonna be one of the ones downstairs. Some joker decided to set up a treasure hunt for any would be thieves. This looks like the one. Where's that wrench? Guess we can. Uh... What? What happened there? I took the books. I've got nothing. Is there supposed to be... Oh, I put the books on the desk. Okay, I hadn't actually made the connection, but is this supposed to be something here the wrench can be used on? Oh, I can push it now. I see, the wrench is used here. That makes more sense. So, makes some sense. Alright, open the panel and there's a secret office. And that's how the head librarian gets into their office. And every day the staff sets up a brand new complicated treasure hunt to confuse them. Hmm. I mean, also the head librarian's office is pretty dingy looking. Bare walls, cobwebs. And there's nothing to do in here? Aha. Uh -huh. That's the book I needed. All right. Let's see if we can kind of clean up a little here. Cover our tracks a bit. <laughs> nah, I can't move that back. Well, they'll know, they'll know something's been here. That's fine. Right, breakfast book resolved. Um, only I had thought that the postcard might be the clue, but I had no reason to connect it in my head. That's the library. Hmm. I heard something. Nah.
Okay, so now... <laughs> we want to get up here. This is wood, right? Want to go back to the bank? Or whatever it was I missed at the bank. So, did I knock out the bank guards? <laughs> yes. So I've only got the alarms to worry about. I think I need to be in a downstairs office. No. Bank president's office, maybe? Right, so there's this lever, which I frogged and it didn't work. It's and I was told I had to look carefully around the bookcase in the office. Uh, maybe there's a bookcase in the other office. Oh, that doesn't make sense. Firstly, I have no idea what the lever did. Am I supposed to be looking at the books? That says 1668. Is that the vault code? 1781. We've got a bunch of years. 1781 again. Surely not. 1484. I mean, I can try them, but. Fourteen eighty four, seventeen eighty one. Feels doesn't feel right. What was the other one? Sixteen sixty eight. Unless it's also just a hidden slip of paper or something. But what was the lever for? I don't understand. What's the lever? What's the lever supposed to do? It doesn't work anymore, so... If it was supposed to do something... else... Didn't do anything here. This is all, this is all inert. Am I gonna have to look this up again? Just go check the other office. The offices. I guess she didn't look on top of it in her office, right? There's not going to be anything in these two. It's going to have to be the same office, surely. Like, why would the lever move something in a completely different office? That makes no sense. You know, the thief terms. All level design terms. <laughs> I 
What am I missing? There's no numbers on the list there. We should ask someone to remove those numbers. Remove what numbers? So like some really dark, almost invisible numbers on the side. There's a smudge. That's not numbers. I mean, if the numbers were on the spine of a book, it wouldn't make sense to say ask someone to remove those numbers, right? What is it that I'm not seeing here? Uh, I don't know, so as much as I don't want to, I'm going to go look it up again. Be right back. All right, I still have no idea what the switch was for, but uh, this is what I missed. Five, four, seven, six. I mean, now I know it's there, it's relatively easy to see, but... Uh, Let's go, let's go, break into that vault. Yeah, stop fussing, there's nobody here. Why would you ever think there was? Seven six. That's all it took. I don't know whether the lever was necessary for that, or maybe the lever moved the bookshelf a bit, or something. What new objectives? So there are safes in this vault too. Find two vault keys in this part of town. Well, I have some unlabeled keys. I am not going to go hunting for more keys that I couldn't find for, because that just... That's just going to take too long. Or maybe that's what the window key is for, you know? Window key. Objective complete. I guess there are a couple more vault keys in the north part of town. If I find them later tonight, I should open the bank window so I can break in more easily. Okay, that's what the window key is for, I see. I have no idea where to look for the vault keys and I'm not gonna go look that up. It's an optional objective, I'll just fail it. That's fine by me, okay, let's uh... Let's just get out of here. Get to the mechanist's place. Oh, 
Alright, stop opening doors into your own bloody face. Get to the Magnus. Maybe we'll find Volkies in part two. I didn't find any here, so... I am not going to scour a map looking for keys that are hard to see, that are hidden away. Seems like asking for trouble. What's the best way down, then? I guess it could go down from Brigantia's place. <sighs> to the teleporter. <laughs> Even that's, that's a very long drop. That's not a safe drop. No, that's not gonna, that's not gonna help. Okay. Can I get out this way? Right, I can get out here and go around. I guess that's what I'm gonna do. me down to the level I need. <laughs> Who cares about a bit of noise, huh? is up the far end. So he's not going to see us sneaking around here, is he? Let's try this teleporter. Okay. So, I guess in mission part two, we'll be maybe be able to get into some of the bank vaults. Too bad I didn't find the first two. We missed. Well, we only missed about two thousand loot. That's not too terrible. Or we missed four secrets though. Interesting. Alright. That mask... What mask? That mask is very valuable. Break into Dicarius Mansion and make it yours. Steal a diary from the Mechanist High Priest. Yes, that's what we know about that. Leave the Mechanist Diary in the Hammer High Priest's desk. Find proof of who is the murderer. Better find his place. That's the apartment in the Northwest. The name, was it Perrin or something like that? Knock out that monster, then leave him in a prison cell, or kill the murderer. Find the other two bulk keys, optional. Should, there should be some loot in the north part too. Steal 5,000. Don't be an amateur, don't kill any harmless people. And after everything is done, go home again. And please wait while it loads lots of textures. Alright, so here we are. Let's just make a save at the start of this mission as well. At the, um. At the mechanist's place.
just a boiler, this, or perchance something worse. A chance. Okay, we could get in the. Oh, he's going to investigate now. That's not good. I shall sniff thee out soon, filthy weed. <clears throat> the wind plays tricks on me today. We go around to the shed on the fire. Well, I mean, sneak past the door and someone goes past it. Well, perfect. Good, good, good. Circle splits the mine, and everybody falls unconscious at once. Exactly the outcome I was hoping for. I, was, I did not expect it, but it was what I was hoping for. Alright. Next time, please do not open the door when I'm trying to sneak past it. It's very rude. Very rude indeed. Okay. Oh, that window is open this time. Okay. The shed is not. That's, uh... Right, alright, thank you. Not lockpicks. Uh, good thing I came around here anyway. <laughs> Someone collects dolls. This is, uh... uh what was the name of that other mission? Spooky Ghost... Mission Victorian Mansion. I forget the name of it. It had that in its attic. It's a model of the uh, of the mansion itself that the mission is set in. Rose Cottage. Rose Cottage. And what are we actually trying to do here? Uh, I mean, we should probably be. See, I thought this was a diversion, but this is going up a lot further than I thought, but... Only a diversion. Well, let's come back here later. Let's try and get the Mechanist's diary first. This is clearly some farm building. Okay. Get the mechanist's diary. Then we're done with the mechanist's place. And we can leave by that building. Right? Where's the map? Yes, yeah, so this is apartment building here. I mean, the other way is we can probably get find the gear and get out the front gate here, but both would be a good option, I suppose. They love their metal, don't they? They love their metal, and it's too far to jump from carpet to carpet, which is convenient for me. Is there anyone else? Anything else in this upper area is just a big fancy entrance hall. That's what it seems to be. There's somebody down there. Brigantia's office. Come on, quick. Someone's coming. Not office, living quarters. Maybe they don't realize she has an apartment nearby. Well, oh, Brigantia, sorry for stealing your money, but hopefully you won't mind. It's kind of mechanist money anyway. The 
Earthlings did so unnatural trance that we feared of the falls. Most unholy rock and good fortune take flight. That was too far for me to reach. Luan. Okay. Neither of those work. Is he coming back? It does sound like he's coming back. And what I think I'm going to do, I think I have no love for the mechanists. I think I'm going to save myself a great deal of trouble from... Oh, he's not coming back. I say I save myself a great deal of trouble from accidental footsteps. Well, where is he then? I'm less, even less happy with not knowing where he is. These guys move fast and hit hard, and they kind of. I can just go to the other end of the hall. All right. I just misinterpreted the. His footstep sound. Alright, we'll try and knock him out as he goes by. Could maybe do a jump to the carpet. Come into the law! Come into the law! Well, you know, he knew Bacanti wasn't around, so he just decided to take a nap on an unoccupied bed. You know, and why not, right? Builder invented sleep, too. Therefore, sleep is also holy. One is unlabeled. Good. Don't, don't come down here. That's right. Go on your merry way. Is any of these valuable? No. I have a feeling she'll be back soon. I also have a feeling I don't have much cover in this place. She's not back here yet. Oh god, thank god. Some less noisy flooring. Plus some more noisy flooring. Okay, I think you're the priest. Is there somebody coming? Cannot tell. I think it's the same mechanism we just saw. No? Maybe not. Beast is not looking this way. And appears to have a key on the belt. But it's a bloody noisy law, so I guess we need to do something about that. Oh, sorry, they are looking this way. They turn around, I see. From time to time. Hmm. It's just not a good setup at all, is it? Hmm. 
Maybe it is the same person. Right. You are out of my way. So I don't need to worry about you seeing me. Priest is looking the other way. Luan room key, alright. Luan Luan. I think I got all unconscious there. So. Yeah, it's just the same room. I just hear some whistling. So not everybody is unconscious everywhere. Yeah, that's good. So it's easier to search a room. For things when the light is on. Hmm. What's going on there? <coughs> I don't know. It does not need to be any of your concern. Sleep in the corner. Not a door. Also not a door. They walking around this hallway as well. Those footsteps I'm hearing, it's very strange. Ah, okay. What's a mechanist with a sword? Still heretical is not. <laughs> Same corner with your friend here. <laughs> You're not quite as bad as the City Watch, but uh, I could really learn to hate these guys. But I could really learn to hate them. Just a hammer right we've got on the slab there. A couple more corpses. Alright. One of these two is a door. Small rope arrows. Convenient. Hmm. 
Another healing potion. That will be very useful for all the fall damage I will inevitably accumulate with my clumsy climbing skills. What? I'm going to lock the chest and not put anything in it. Yeah, it's mechanists. Wait, there's another door at the end of the corridor. No, it's not a door, okay. Question answered. And also... Got just my skills. Wow, so far a full size. Not even funny. Still aiming too high. Garrett, you're going to lose your bow license if you keep this up. That's more like it. Okay. Non doors. Oh, is this just the same? This is just the same passage. Okay, what? Well, first of all, who is the mechanist high priest? Second of all, where does he keep his diary? This is surely not a high priest room, right? Let's just have the gate. Steal the diary from the mechanist priest. Oh, the mechanist priest, not the mechanist high priest. But, uh, the diary is not in this room. The cabinet does not open. Gantia did not have it. Gosh, you surprised me there, mate. I know I left you there, but you surprised me anyway. It's your fault, not mine. It's like, this room is empty. There's <laughs> someone's asleep on the bed. What? Did I miss a door in this area? I mean, I could have. It doesn't look like I did. Well, this is a great start, Garrett. You come here for one thing only, and you're just not even able to do that, are you? Were there any doors along this passage that I missed? So then where, you know what, let's, let's, while I wander around, let's do some practical joking with these jokers. Ah, oh. oh, well, you know, it, it counts as much as I can. Not a door, not a door. Uh. 
Just the same cat. This is just the same uh, passageway. What am I missing? Doesn't seem to be a diary in this entire place. I mean, I guess I can come back here if I need to. Maybe the priest has quarters elsewhere. That doesn't. I guess it's possible. Um, I can leave this place. I've got the gate here, so I can go open the gate. Alright, let's let's leave. Let's go through the apartments to the north. But first open the gate. I can come back here if I need to. I'm probably gonna need to. It feels pretty pretty likely that I'm gonna need to. But at least I have a bunch of other objectives I can pursue and deal with those and um, maybe find out what I'm missing later on. Not a door, right? Okay. This is a door. Feels like we're just going back the same way. Wait, what? Is this just an empty apartment? No loot under the beds. It's just a completely empty apartment. Okay. It's not a door. I don't understand why, but it's fine. On your mental piece there. Nope. Some nice fine china, I'll take it. Hello. hiding somewhere? Did I miss? Got that. I missed that. What about Q A minor? No key hiding at the piano. Turn the lights on. All right. So up in here we have a key. Do we need? 
Well, actually, I mean, I've got some keys, right? I should have the same inventory that I had. Well, I guess I could check whether any of these... No, I do not have the keys. I have some of the same inventory, I think. My, uh, my arrows and stuff, but not keys. The door. But an open window. Which will do. These people are very poor in terms of <laughs> valuable stuff for me to steal. Right, there's the mechanists. More warehouses. I see. What is this place? In this chimney. Well, a couple of gold candlesticks. Some fire pokers and stuff. A firewood, a nice clock, but not really valuable. <coughs> ah, Garrett. When you're supposed to mantle, don't jump backwards. <gasps> Okay. Doesn't feel like the warehouse is going to give me the key that I need there. I guess we'll have to find out. It's the only way forward. <coughs> Ouch. I realized it's just a moment too late that that drop was higher than I was happy with. So we can get inside there. And continue. Oh, maybe maybe it's not a continuation. This looks like just a room with some trinkets. Or one trinket. Not quite sure how I teleport it back behind the uh, window like that, but that's Magic of mantling. <laughs> Wonder if there's like any of these crates open or anything. Have a key on his belt. Doesn't seem to. This thing is a big lock. Nothing suspicious at all about that, right? Two elevators. That one goes up to the next floor. This is... Right, this one just goes up to the next level.
Well, I guess there's any reason for me to... ...be up here. Doesn't really seem like it. What about the other side? Also, it does not seem like it. Let's, um... Ow. Not what I wanted to do. Bring the elevator down. Speaking of bringing the elevator down, is there anything hiding under, t under this elevator? It sometimes happens, you know? I didn't intend to fall in, but that's fine. So, there could be all kinds of openable crates. Wow. I thought Amazon shipping was extreme, but that's an enormous crate for three small, uh, you know, Am Amazon's excessive use of of shipping material for our small things, but that's that's even more amazing. Alright, that means now I have to feel like I have to check every side of every crate, which is not a happy feeling. <laughs> but okay. Won't take long. I guess I didn't check every side of that upper crate, but... Hello, what have we got here? So everything in the supper floor. Wow, those crates don't actually even look like they would fit on this elevator. Maybe they would just barely. Oh. I definitely misjudged the height there. Well, that was my own silly fault. It's more uh, healing potions, aren't they? <laughs> Any this crate open? Same too, okay. Layers. Oh, it's just crane controls. Interesting, okay. Oh, 
Well, that might get me somewhere. What about this house? Not just a single room. This goes where west of the warehouse, right? So this is in here. Seems like it connects. There's a guard here. This is definitely a further place to go, but I don't want to go just yet. Continuing south. Let's see if we can. Uh, Right, this is going to take us to Mr. D. This is Mr. No, oh, his name isn't here. Mr. Rich Man D. Who has a mask. What we need to steal. But, that is going to be in the next episode. So, thanks for watching. And I'll see you then.